Windows Live Movie Maker is a PC editing program that's part of the Windows 7 operating system. This new version of Movie Maker has streamlined the footage import process and simplified the editing interface without losing any functionality. The biggest change to the editing interface is the omission of the timeline, leaving only the storyboard. They've added batch editing, which allows you to perform the same action to several clips at a time instead of individually. They've also added one-click title edition. The old Windows Movie Maker for XP and Vista came preloaded onto your computer with the operating system install. If you have the Windows 7 operating system, Windows Movie Maker Live is a free download from the internet. So let's take a look at the new interface. Windows Live Movie Maker's interface is divided into three sections. The ribbon style menu bar at the top, the storyboard, and the preview window. The menu bar along the top includes different tabs that allow you to accomplish different things. The tab you'll be working in most of the time is the Home tab. This is where you'll find basic editing functions, as well as buttons that allow you to bring in photos or video. You can also find the Sharing option under this tab. Just on the right of the Home tab is the Animations tab. The Animation tab lets you add transitions and moves to your video or photos. Next is the Visual Effects tab that lets you add an effect to your video. And finally, the View tab, which lets you adjust the ways you can look at your storyboard and preview window. The preview window lets you preview video clips and photos individually. It also plays back your edited movie. The storyboard is where you will lay out the shots in your movie. It plays from left to right and top to bottom. And that's the Windows Live Movie Maker interface. In the next lesson, we're going to look at how to create a new project.